They started cooking up something special in Golden Valley, Minnesota this week. 20 volunteers joined the pie lady, Rose McGee. They baked 86 sweet potato pies. Destination, Charleston. Not just any pie, but yeah. a sweet potato pie. That's the one I want. On Wednesday night, interim pastor of Mother Emanuel, Reverend Norval Goff Sr., welcomed the women who baked them into his Bible study. I want to say thank you, and I guess I get a hug from both of you, you for the do, pies. Right. Uh, thank you for the pies. Thank you so much. Rose hopes her comfort pies, as she calls them, can help in just a small way to let the parishioners here at Mother Emanuel know that people around the country are still thinking about them and praying for them. We were bringing love, we were bringing joy from our community to here, and they're pies, and we, uh, I'm just thankful that they received them. Reverend Goff spoke about loving your neighbors at the Bible study Wednesday night, something he says was perfectly exemplified by Rose's pies. I think it's one day at a time. I think the journey is still a long ways off, but the good news is that we're not on this journey by ourselves. Bible study came to an end last Wednesday night. I just got a piece of pie. Yes, Rose waited, their hearts now fed, their stomachs would be too. I hope they like them. I hope they don't eat the pie and go, what she bring those pies on with Minnesota for? Oh, yeah. I don't know anybody who would turn this down. <laughs> and the reviews. The pie was great. <laughs> it's very good. One lady who works right here at the church, all she said was, mm mm. Mm mm. <laughs> we filmed it. <laughs> now, that to me was the best compliment that I could have gotten. Many of the Bible study members, knowing they're not alone in this healing process, was the most satisfying piece of the pie. You hug your neighbors back in Minnesota for us. Nicole Butler, News 2.